Hey everyone, so I'm going to be doing another unboxing. This is Diana Cooper's Archangel Animal Oracle Cards. And this is a pretty decent sized deck. It's, I would say, medium. And this is what it looks like on the side. And then this is the back. You can pause it if you want. And then this is the other side. And that is the top. And it is by Hay House. And this is what it says on the inside. Open your heart to the archangels and animals and be inspired by their love and guidance. And it comes with a small companion book. And it's glossy finish. And it kind of looks glossy, but it's almost like a matte energy matte finish and the book is black and white and again it gives the card what it means it goes in more in depth about each card and then it goes into the table of contents has some spreads in here and I believe this is the back of it. This is the artist, Diana. And I had some decks from her previously and I wasn't like resonating with them, but this one I'm pretty sure I'm gonna resonate pretty deeply with. And it's a nice little ending to the companion book. And for those that want to know, it's 139 pages. And one of the last pages is about the author. So then we're going to flip them out. There's nothing in the inside of the bottom, but it comes with this slip here, this paper slip, which I'm just going to rip it because I'm not going to use it. And this is the back. So I'm going to go ahead and flip them over and get to them. So we got the ant, badger, sorry guys, I'm gonna move it a little bit so you can see it better without the ring light, I'm trying to move the ring light a little, I really like these. That one's really beautiful, the bee. This does have a glossy finish on the cards and the card stock is pretty good. It's little bit flimsy um they can bend i would you see they already got when i went like this it kind of felt like it bent already you could see it kind of curving already so i'd be careful if you're someone that shuffles aggressively like me i would um try to be careful if you want to keep them flat and in mint condition as much as possible If you're just gonna read with them and you're not gonna really like keep them mint condition to resell or anything like that, I think it'd be fine. But if you're considering using them and selling them later, I would be very careful. has different animals, which is nice because you usually see a lot of repeats when you get animal decks. But yeah, that's the cards. And I really like them. I think I'll be using them quite a bit. And let me know what your guys' favorite card was. Likes, dislikes. And if you use them, let me know what kind of readings you use them for. Is it just spirit guides? As far as animal guides, do you use it for 
all types of readings. Do you use it for healing? I'm curious to know. And I will be back with one more deck reveal or flip through. But that might not be for a couple days. But I will post it as soon as I get it and get it recorded. So I will see you guys hopefully soon again. And I hope to hear from you guys. Thanks for watching.